from VOA Learning English. This is the Science Report. As the population grows and temperatures rise, it will become more difficult to grow enough food for everyone. So scientists are looking for plants that need less water than today's crops. The U.S. Mojave Desert in California is home to some of these plants. Scientist Heather Rose Cates of the University of Florida searches the desert for a plant called the coyote melon. They are in the same plant family as butternut squash, zucchini, and pumpkins. Those vegetables are popular around the world. Ms. Cates describes the coyote melon's flavor as terrible. She is collecting the coyote melon because it can be grown in places with little rainfall. Other kinds of squash need much more water to grow. Scientists are considering combining wild coyote melon with regular squash to see if they can make a tasty vegetable that doesn't need as much water to grow. Andy Jarvis works at the International Center for Tropical Agriculture. He says farmers will need to produce 50 to 70 percent more food by 2050 to feed the world. Mr. Jarvis says researchers are studying the wild versions of farm-grown crops. The problem is many wild versions of farm plants and their seeds are disappearing. Ms. Cates is part of an international effort to gather these plants and save their seeds for future use. Workers are collecting wild oats in Cyprus, wild potatoes in Argentina, and wild peppers in Paraguay. The plants and seeds will be sent for storage to the Global Seed Vault in Norway and at Kew Gardens in Britain. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.